the most important thing uh, that there that was said tonight, the takeaway message is early detection saves lives and increases the likelihood of uh, long-term survival. Um, if you can uh, find uh, a little tiny cancer on a polyp uh, and take it off, uh, the chances of your uh, surviving colon cancer are nearly 100%. If you uh, are found to have an obstructing lesion, a colon cancer that's blocking up your colon, uh, the chances of your survival uh, for uh, five years is less than 15%. So uh, you need to have faith in your doctor, even though he wants to uh, aggravate you in unmentionable places, and um, get your uh, screenings done, um, both on an annual basis for those non-invasive screenings and, and on a more um, uh, invasive basis on a more regular basis, uh, on a less frequent uh, screening. There is, there has been uh, um, advancement in, the, in uh, some of the uh, tests. Uh, the colon uh, rectal blood test has been the standard for years. There's now a blood test that we can use to detect the type of DNA that's found in colon cancers uh, in your blood. Uh, it's called a colovantage, and colovantage, and that, uh, and its uh, progeny will set the stage for increasing uh, awareness and survival and, and early detection of colon cancer. So uh, I think that uh, it won't be long before there's a completely new day in uh, uh, t detecting this malignancy and taking care of uh, the possibility of people waiting too late.